Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jack Petrie. I'm Idris. And I'm Kelsey. All right. So, who in here likes buffalo buffalo chicken? I love buffalo chicken. Love it. I am also a big fan of buffalo chicken. Who in here likes pizza? Can't pass up a pizza. Exactly. I love pizza. And uh, who else in here likes watching sports? I love it. All My right. With a uh, dude dip, we have combined buffalo chicken and pizza in a dip that's convenient for watching sports. Okay, well, uh, dude dip has the taste of pizza and buffalo chicken with the convenience of a single product. Uh, it's made with mozzarella cheese, cream cheese, uh, pizza sauce, and um, buffalo chicken. Better pizza. Our target market is men in college towns and major cities and major league sports teams because that's where jam meeting is popular and you can find our dip. And we chose to start targeting in Green Bay because it's popular sports teams. Alright, so here we have our packaging. We have it highlighting from red to yellow. We have the red because red is the color of buffalo, buffalo chicken. Fading to yellow for the color of the cheese. So there customers know basically what flavor is happening. And here's our logo, Dude Dip highlighting our, our uh, brand. We have buffalo, buffalo wing and pizza highlighting our flavor. And we have the thumbs up because the thumbs up is a stamp of approval among men. Um, we plan on selling Dude Dip at all major grocery stores like Schnucks and Deerbergs because they are a place all around the U.S. and they're convenient for the areas that we're trying to target. We started selling our product at $4 because um, the price of our competitors is $4.50 to $5 and we didn't want to. We wanted to keep it lower to gain our customers' trust and our competition are similar dips in the same aisle because we're competing for our customers' sale. Alright, so you should buy our product uh, I mean, you should invest in our product because we have shown great success. We have gotten 4.6 ratings out of 40 total uh, testers. We've tested here at the school, and we've gotten good ratings from everyone. It takes about $10 to make three and a half badges, so that comes out to about $3 a badge. And selling it at $4 gives us a $1 profit line. But honestly, once your company will invest in us, we can mass produce, and the price of uh, manufacturing can go down. So I'll have a larger profit line. So where can we begin? Tell me about what the closest competing product on the market is. I believe the closest competing product would be something like a queso dip or a salsa dip. This is something that's also popular at tailgating events or sporting events because... Hmm, how should I put this? Because our product is no other flavor like this, so we have to limit it to another dip. And this is all. These are dips that are popular among everyone else. Does this dip need to be refrigerated? This dip does need to be refrigerated. It can be eaten cold or warm. So we'll put on the label how it heat up for five minutes or so, and you'll have a warm dip, or you can eat it cold. Do you see this posing any problems at tailgates when it's hot out? It can pose some problems, but if you want, if you start out cold, it won't. So it'll pop and be delicious. What time of year do you think would be best to introduce this product? I think football season because we are target. Well, our test market is in Green Bay. In Green Bay, we chose them because they're known for their tailgating. And so, tailgating mostly goes on football season. So, we should start our product out in football season, gain the most customers. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thank you. This one.